hi guys so this is my fridge and <laughs> i am going to show you today what all things you can freeze uh, because this is the time when you're working from home and you want to know like what all things you can freeze so that you don't have to go again and again to the grocery shop so let me show you what all things i have frozen so you can get an idea so let me open the freezer so things i have i shouldn't keep it open for a long time in recent pieces now i have just chopped few uh, bananas and kept it green, green chili tomatoes you can see pretty easy you can see over here i have just chopped them i kept it them in a plate covered with a uh, plastic sheet and then took it out and then froze it in a ziploc bag so this is a previous batch this is the new batch and below that i have frozen cheese cheese can be easily frozen so this is something below that i have a pizza crust uh, sorry a uh, pizza base that also can be frozen so this is cheese for a bit messed up freezer but how it is right then I have some grated cheese also it can be frozen um, some mint I have a grated coconut as well this can be easy frozen and yeah spinach so this is my ice cream cube the ice cream set whatever you call it i'm not sure what you call it exactly so i have just uh, washed and blended uh, spinach and kept it in this and frozen it i initially i covered it with uh, aluminium foil and kept it like this so whenever i need it i just take it out and then use it otherwise even you can do is take it out from this and put it in a ziploc bag that is another option there's another ice cube in this i have frozen uh, yogurt yeah that also can be frozen so that is one option available these are my frozen and cheese seeming time this is a frozen so this is nothing that i have frozen separately so if i am fast i think i have said a lot of things fast so you can actually put that in the comment section i'll tell you what all i have frozen See, this is what happens when you keep the door, don't close the door properly. So that's my point. Okay, now see, I kept, uh, this is cream. So I used the same ice cube, put the cream in that, frozen it and then took it out and kept it in a Ziploc bag. That's frozen dahi, done same way, frozen yogurt, curd, whatever you call it. These are the frozen peas. and kept it this also you can feel it properly okay. and i have mint also so mint is also something which gets spoiled pretty easily so i have frozen mint you can see the mint over here right and what I, have? I have cauliflowers also chopped and kept it Then bread is something also which is in free. I have frozen the bread. Some spinach. I have just kept it like that. I haven't uh, like blended it. Just frozen directly in the bag. And I have some blueberries over here frozen. Frozen strawberries. Yeah. So these all things frozen you can see i have to close the fridge now so you can freeze so many things and keep it so that you don't have to go back to the grocery shop again mm. you can even chop vegetables like beans capsicum carrot cauliflower a lot of other vegetables you can even make a paste of ginger and garlic and freeze those can freeze milk 
an n number of things like if you want to know additional what all things you can freeze you can put them in the comment section below other people can also help you with the answers as well as i'll try to help you uh, so there are a lot of things which can be free so that freeze it now and then you can like use them later and you don't have to go to the grocery shop or the vegetable vendor again and again because these are a bit scary times and we don't feel that comfortable going out pretty often so this is a very good option so freezing vegetables and different grocery stuff and they'll stay good and they'll be fine don't worry about that the taste also don't change the things are frozen the taste doesn't change that much and yeah that's it so be safe wash your hands uh the good way to uh, wash a vegetable if you're worried about that is uh, wash it under uh, flowing water like start open your tap and then just wash it on under that don't put it in a bowl Uh, the running water will help to remove if any virus is there in those vegetables so that's the tip i can give you and yeah that's it so if you like my video give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel i'll let you know about what all things are happening in netherlands in some time so yeah see you then stay safe stay at home bye bye